Let's try another stun. There we go. Okay. Now we get another plasma weapon. I'm sure that was worth it. Uh, let's move the medic out to here. Throw a heal on this guy. Four wounds. Wait. Is he... Where's the damage? Oh yeah, so he's got three health still removed. Which isn't good. Uh, heavy. Heavy can move to this cover. We can see that enemy. 60% chance to hit. We're gonna leave it with suppression. And then get everyone in a better position to attack him next turn. So we're gonna move the sniper to... here and can't see so we'll throw her into overwatch with her pistol she's gonna move up to here she can't reach him with a grenade so she'll go into overwatch sniper will move up to behind this truck going to overwatch with the pistol I don't know if anyone's out here I doubt it I think I would have hurt them at this point but yeah I think you're pretty good on that side okay so he's still pinned down for that turn we got to reload with this guy um, sniper still can't see him though we can move her Behind this pillar. Still can't see him. But we can frag him. It's all full cover, that's why. Nope. Can't can't even get a frag grenade. Overwatch. Move to here. Overwatch. Uh, medic. We'll leave that guy with three damage on him. He should be fine for now. We'll throw the medic into a You might as well heal it up. Just so that he's not stuck in uh, uh, the, like the infirmary. He'll still uh, go to the infirmary if he's uh, if he's been damaged. Oh, that's true, yeah. Unless it's like only for grievous wounds, but yeah. Yeah, can't reach with a grenade there. We could move closer. But that seems risky with the sniper because she doesn't really have much health at all. Um, we'll throw her into Overwatch uh, with the sniper rifle and see what happens. There's a whole other building over there. Where, where'd he go? Oh, that's not good. Uh, shoot. And there's no cover now. I've blown it all up. So we're going to have to move these guys. You can just guys. hunker down. Well, not hunker down, but just like go and overwatch. The problem is I need to move up to catch up with some of these other ones. So we're going to run him there. We're going to heal him the last couple points, actually, because this map looks like it's a bit bigger than I thought it was going to be. Nothing's broken. You're fine. And then we'll... It doesn't really make sense to use run and gun just to get up to there and then go into overwatch. We're going to move around the other side of this pillar, and then hopefully he'll be able to get to a closer position next turn. Uh, throw him into overwatch. She is gonna move up to that pillar against my better judgment and then go into overwatch with her pistol I think we have enough people in overwatch that we should be safe but can never be sure oh flanking an alien oh, I see him uh, I don't think I can do 
four damage. Go for it. Oh wait, you can her do pistol it. does it. I forgot her pistol does four damage. Ah, oh, it did three. Okay, so she's probably gonna get shot next round, but again... Oh! Yeah. That's not good. Miss. Everyone misses. What? He didn't attack? Who else can she see? Only a 68% chance to hit that one. Um, we'll move up to here with pistol. Attack that guy. Should kill him. Great. Uh, medic. We'll throw down a smoke, catching everyone. Oh man, he's in that. Uh, he's in that alleyway. <laughs> the shelf. Shelf. Thank you. That was the word I was looking for. Uh, <laughs> we'll throw the heavy into Overwatch. We'll move. The rookie can see three people or two people two aliens. Has a 65% chance to hit that one. We'll give that a try. That's a miss. Uh, we'll move up to here with the assault. And we'll throw him into Overwatch. She can see two. She's not in a great position, but hopefully Smoke will save her. She'll try a headshot on... This one with 75%. And that's going to be a miss. Oh no! A hit, but not a kill. Oh no. I might be able to throw a grenade up there. Oh, but I kind of need the weapon fragments. Probably should try and kill him without it. What? No uh. way. Okay. This is not good. She, I mean, she was behind smoke and full cover and somehow he got a crit. It's dumb. Headshot. 40. There we go. Sniper hauling out the crazy odds for the kills. Oh, she earned another promotion. Nice. Uh, we're going to move him up into this cover. You can see that one for 81. Why can't we see the other one? Oh, whatever. Let's give it a try. And a miss with an 81%. Amazing. Huh. Uh, let's see, where do we want to move to? Assault does have run and gun still up. Let's activate it. Uh, move up to full cover behind here. And still can only see one. 67% chance. Will we have a better chance of hitting with this one, not really. Let's flush. And the reason I flush is because I know it has a much higher chance to hit, but with very little damage. And 95% chance here. This sniper will clean it up. And that's it. Nice. That wasn't horrible. But the United States is panicking. And there's nothing we can really do about that. Uh, promotion? Low profile. Uh, makes partial cover count as full cover. Wow, that's pretty awesome. Getting a lot of experience. That's because she cleans up. She cleans up hardcore. 
she basically is the one getting most of the kills, I think. Let's find out. Where is Major Productions? Yeah, 11 missions, 17 kills. Racking it up. So, uh, I guess the only thing to do is scan for more activity and in 16 days we lose the US. Shoot. That satellite finished, or we, the satellite station finished and we had one satellite ready to go. Um, you can deploy it right now. Yeah. We're going to deploy oh, it. Oh, but it's already, you already have one in the States. Yeah. If I deploy it in Canada, that doesn't make a difference, does it? No. Shoot. Okay. And there's no real point in putting it in either of these two, because if I end up losing the United States, I can't get the benefit from this section, right? Yeah, that's right. Let's throw it in Australia to try and keep that one down. And then we're going to go for the full, uh, these four to try and get the bonus, uh, for half cost on foundry and officer training, right? I believe that's the bonus I get I from so. them. Yep. Yeah, future combat. I think that's it. So we're going to throw one in Australia. Uh... China will give me more money, but no, we'll get the panic down. Okay. Now, we got 200 credits from completing that mission in China. So we're going to go in here, and in Asia, we're going to order another interceptor. Um, that way we can have more coverage to try and shoot Africa. down. And oh, was it? Shoot. Cancel order. I don't know. That didn't get my money back, did it? Nope. Actually, I don't know. I think I had 200. I still have 160. Yeah, 202. Just go back. Yeah. Go back? Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay, canceling didn't seem to do much. Okay, so we're going to get one in Asia so that when if we can actually deal with uh, enemies if they pop up there. It's all about getting... Uh, they want three heavy lasers. For, and they'll give me 300. Well. Wow. I don't know if we can buy or make three heavy lasers. No, because we don't have the alloys. I don't know if I would do that even if we uh, had the ability to do it. Okay. Plasma cannon is done. That's probably something we should have. Uh, and I don't really want to research... Uh, well, we need to do this anyways. I'm not going to use UFO com flight computers for anything else. We'll get that one done. Mm. the plasma cannons I would need a ridiculous amount of stuff and I have none of it so scanning that's done assign new research uh, satellite nexus with the signal monitoring monitored by a team of engineers each satellite nexus is capable of receiving transmission for four XCOM satellites adjacency bonus plus one satellite capacity for each adjacent uplink so that's a better version of the satellites oh and stealth satellites by studying the communication signals by of USA UFO nav computers we've covered we could, could update our satellite network to mimic the alien communications this would make the satellites much harder to detect if the aliens were to go looking for them cool and there's no other research we can do right now because we just don't have the um, resources and oh uh, that is UFO we can, can go in here and we can buy a dodge for three floater corpses and an aim. Aims are really yeah. cheap. Okay, we're going to buy an aim for sure and we're going to buy a dodge for 42 and we're going to do this and I'm going to save because we have went through a mission and I want to keep progress saved. Okay. Uh, we're gonna launch Raven One. Oh, and if we l if we lose one, we can send another one because we have two interceptors here. This ship's going down. Nice. Enemy is padlocked. All right, let's throw up an aim. Oh, this is a small one. Is it? 
Yep. Dodge. We're gonna lose the contact. 